Welcome to a new video, and today we're going to be doing Kineo Pet from memory. And honestly, I don't, I actually don't know how this is going to work, since I roughly know how his body works, as I'll be doing a basic, well, a basic body with a cube, since it should, yeah, yeah, should work, since if I, I'll just go here, size them. We'll see about here. Might be a bit too big, but it'll be good enough. Split in there. Now we gotta think. How will his body look? So we'll go to the side. Split. And X ray. We'll go here. And possibly like this. Just so he's now rounded. So if I do 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 generate subdivision, he's gonna look like that, which I think will be correct. So I can go bang bang, expand, edit him. Let's see. Yeah, it looks good. Then I can boom boom. Yeah, it works. I think. Then I should be able to bang, 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 bang. Okay. So I need to do a mouth, I think. I can do normal eyes, so I can draw the mouth on. Just scribble it there. Yeah, it works. So I guess the body can be kind of good, but I think... Hold on. Bang. Bang. There you go. Nice. Like that. So it'll be an eye here. Eye here. Tiny things purple. Make some sticks for the axolotl. Because he's an axolotl, I think. So I'll do the legs, actually. On its own. So... If I get a cube, and that's not a cube, that's a plane. If I get a cube, bang, save. His leg should be roughly about this thin. Go down. We'll save out here. Yeah, that's good. Side view. And we'll go like there. I'll subdivide the leg actually as well, so it's much more fair. Edit your leg, bing, bong, bang, right in the middle, so when I want to copy it over, it'll get pasted right there. Gee whiz, I'm intelligent. That should work, so I can split, split, I want the knee to be around here somewhere. So I could just go bang again. So I roughly know his legs. So I could put one round about here, I think. I can cut, 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 and cut. Do that. Throw you here. Yeah, that should work. Pop you down a bit. Could be there. Yeah, it works. Subdivide. So we have an idea, an idea, really. 
split. And spin and do that. And shorten and this. There we go. That should work. And I can texturize you and stick more on. But bang, 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 bang. You'll see what I'm doing here. So let's add mini little feathers. Or whatever the things are called in there. Little antennas. Three should be enough. Let's exclude. Just about here. So that I can move them around. Just the bottom ones. Since they're kind of annoying. Just like that. See, he somewhat has a shape. Insert terrible PNG right around here. And I should be equal like him, I guess. So what else do I need? Eyes. Which is really just a Sophia. I'll do about that big. Yeah. Yeah. Up. Edit. Bang. Right about here. Increase you a bit bigger, actually. Move you back. There you go. Spin by 90. Yeah, looks good. Um, what else? Ah, yes. His little smile. Which would be? Pitch black. So we'll go side to side, like? I f right, let's think a bit. So, does he have a smile? He has a mouth, I know that. But it's more of a short one to here, so let's see. I do have my X axes on, so I can go... There we go. That might actually work. Save as always. We don't want to lose our work, do we? So there's the mouth really done. Nothing special. Let's go. Edit again. Select. UV. Smart Wrap. Go into our textures. We make a new one. Called. Kin. T O I. Bang! See? Now it's all mapped out. We then go back down again. Put that on just in case. And we'll just call Kin To I. Image texture as always. And get the Kin To E. There you go. So obviously the entire thing's white. So we'll go do that. There we go. Wham. Then we select the eye. So about there, I think. We'll see about that. We may need it a bit bigger. There we go. He may look a bit derpy, but it works. So as I done, even I might put them up a bit more. Just about here. Yeah, he looks a bit dodgy, but he works. 
can't handle everything. Bang. Boom. And we'll call this... Kingy Toe. Tent. Text. There we go. Go down. Bang, bong, bing. Kingy Tech. Tint. You don't need a spell when it comes to making things. Image. Into. Kingy Toe Tent. Net. There we go. So, as again, we get the correct colour. Bing, bang, bong. Wham. We may make it a bit darker. A bit brighter. A bit darker. There we go. Pink like a dark purple. See, he looks brilliant. The legs will be easier since they'll just be black, I think. I think. Me thinks. So we can go bang. Crit text. Do that. Bing. Black. And we'll go to shading. So I can copy this. Copy. Do that. Delete that. Paste that. There you go. Your legs look normal. Go back again. So you got some dodgy legs, but at least you look good. He looks roughly decent. Obviously, I'll be embarrassed when I look at the actual image of him when I do some fabulous posing of him. But we'll see how bad it looks. So, let's dupe him. Put you down a bit. Move you to the side a bit. Dupe you again. Put you to the side again. And put you to the side again. There we go. We now have an idea. So we'll go... Bang bang. Do. Control M. 2X. And we pop you to a side again. And it would roughly be about... You may be gelatin like that, but we aren't really gonna move your body, are we? Because it's really just the legs that you use, I think. So there's him done. So now, what else will we do? Simple. We'll make a surfboard. Well, I hope he has one, if I remember. So we'll do that. We'll put you all the way to the side. Do that, and we'll say it's about this thing. Edit. Yes. Yeah, that looks good. So now we have to bing bang, boom. you down a bit and I think this area is just normal so we'll put you there like well yeah, you're obviously more sharper a bit, 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 bit wide skinny yeah that works edit mode bang bang Subdivide like that. So now we have a texture to paint on here. Yeah, just checking. So, how will we do it now? So, it's obviously curved and bent a bit. So, I'll do this.
So we'll select and do that. Oops. And forward. Maybe a bit back a bit. Just about here. Looks nice. To an extent, obviously. And we might as well do you as well. Just so you're slightly bent. There we go, that should look decent enough. So let's go. Just because it's making me a bit annoyed, it'll smooth you all out. By level 3. Because level 3 is more friendly. If the eyes can look like that because he looks derpy. Watch him not have an actual mouth. Oof. So let's obviously open another screen up because I forgot who. Image, editor, do that, make a new one called Surf Bard Text, save it, go down, Surf Bird, hashtag, no we don't need one, image texture, go in, Seth Bard. And I roughly know the colour, I think. So I think it is a nice greenish colour about that type. Which is all over. The middle of it, now that's a good question. And about here. Yeah? Yeah, it looks good. And I think it's white. Methinks. Yeah, decent. Although. Just to make you a bit more nicer. It'll make you a bit thicker. There we go, we now have a surfboard, which is roughly the correct size of him. So that shows that he is really done, I think. So, we could make him a scene, just to be more fancy, so let's do it. Making a scene is actually not one of my things, but I think we'll need a plane. Make him mega big right about here whoa kind of big there so turn you around by this much So 
who's distinctively looking at the camera. Just like that. Now I can move your leg, so how does he stand? It's more like a sassy torn, I'd say. So we can move your leg about here. You're like chilling. usually like this maybe a bit too maybe a bit too far but it'll work bang bing moves it like that Yeah, it works. Let's get a camera just in case. Just to give him some sort of look. Ah, of course, you want to be idiotic like that. There we go. Make you all look back over here. Yep. And move you all the way here. Move you down a bit. Hmm. Just like that. So now we have our Kunito pet in a weird looking style, I guess. But at least the looks at the camera and yeah by the end of all of this i'll be looking at him and go oh well he doesn't look correct as i am looking through the editing and i'm comparing the two of them i'm like what what did i actually it doesn't even look like right right so the only things i've missed from the character are the eyelids and that's it that's the only thing that's missing the other thing that's wrong is that he has he doesn't have a mouth, apparently. I, I don't know where that came from, like, but I always thought he had a mouth. The next thing is... Probably a bit too wide. The legs seem perfect off the ro of overall. Um, well, it's just like, yeah, too thick, no eyelids, has, has a mouth. So overall, I hope you enjoyed this video and, um, well enjoyed the video of how I try to create Kanito Pet from memory.